welcome to the channel here on bestbluesguitarlessonsonline.com. I'm Anthony and I will take you through a really cool minor blues progression. And there was a guy here on the channel who asked a question on one of the last videos about advanced blues guitar soloing. And he asked how to play uh, this kind of... This kind of thing, and as he rightfully pointed out, Roddick, who uh, asked the question, he stated that it's a minor blues thing, and it is indeed a minor blues thing. I will first play such thing, and then we will walk uh, through uh, this type of rhythm guitar playing. <laughs> So here it's a little minor blues thingy we're playing. It's a 12 bar blues and we're using the minor 7 chords but we're adding a 9th to that chord. So basically the chord I'm playing here, if you would play it in a full chord, I'm playing it just with 3 fingers here but I'm adding the root note before it. If you play it with 4 fingers, you basically play the root note on the A string then we have the seventh tone of the chord here on the D string. It's gonna be the G note on the fifth fret. Then I finger the G, uh, G string here, fourth fret. So it's the B note, that's the ninth of the chord. And now at the pinky finger, I play the B note here on the fifth fret. So this is basically the chord I'm going for, but I'm just playing a little minor is sliding here uh, with a little bass line in front of it so instead of playing this thing in a sort of a rhythm this chord I'm just adding a little bass line from the G to the A note with a passing tone here so this is our little bass line and then the sliding is just I'm using here, those three fingers from that chord, but instead of fingering it with pinky finger, I use the first three fingers. And then I slide it two frets higher and back down. So this is the riff that surrounds the one chord. And then since we're just playing a regular 12 bar minor blues progression, the 4 chord is going to be the D minor 7 chord. Now we're adding also the 9 with this little sliding. So the little bass riff now starts on the C note and walks up all the way to the D note here, the root note of the 4 chord. So we can play the same thing that we played here over the A, no, over the four chords. Back to the one. Over the five is going to be walking up to the E note with the little bass line and then sliding it's going to start on the 12th fret with uh, those two fingers here, middle finger and ring finger. And then one fret lower the index. I'm going to slide it two frets higher and back down. So it's basically the same line. So this is it. Thanks for asking the question, Radek, and uh, I hope uh, the others who viewed this video will enjoy this little riff as well. Don't hold back to uh, ask any kind of questions in the comment section or just to give feedback. It's always great to hear 
from others. And if you want to go deeper into rhythm guitar styles, I would say also uh, take a look at the website bestbluesguitarlessonsonline.com where you can download a blues guitar rhythm ebook that you can download for free and then you can go into tablature examples and written out text as well so i hope you enjoyed this and see you in the next video